look and face, but it was the fact that she was one of the best looking tranny. Okay. Sad to admit. Now look what happened as she aged. Women don't age like this. It's like aging like Madonna. Okay. You see that same chin, the chin widened, the jaw widened. That's odd. I mean, somebody with a face like this do not age like this. They don't. I look at older people all the time. They don't age like that. Okay. When people get older, you lose estrogen uh, and that's when the skin can sag and everything. Okay. This is not normal aging process. Okay. It, this is not. You, this is not making sense. Going from here to here, no, not making sense. They'll have longer face, if anything, when they get older, okay? They'll have more sunken. Now, if they gain weight, it will be proportional, okay? You don't end up having a square face from a long face, no. Maybe you'll have a little oval. So that's, that's, you know, again, you see, share, okay? They make it, they gave her a big butt here. I don't know where that butt came from. I don't remember her having a big butt, but, you know, they gave her a big butt here. This must be, like, photoshopped, and they did it wrong because this is, the again, the folding. This is the taco, the taco style. Taco style here, too. So I guess I, I'm wrong. Kim Kardashian does have that low low lying low back geez I mean can I get a real woman in 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 this thing I just it's 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 weirding me out um, let me show you okay cuz this would make a little more sense this is normal okay that's like in the this is a tall person you see the scapula do you see how small that scapula is that's not a man man's scapula will be more squarish it's not going to be this teeny tiny because this is a very skinny person okay um if she gained weight the small of the back will be more here right now it's appearing dipping down because of the less weight so less weight you're not going to see the c-curve as well it will be a lesser degree of a c-curve so um okay one picture she just gave birth you see stretch marks, okay? Okay, is this a woman? This is from Kenya. Somebody's very upset with me and I don't care, okay? They don't like the fact that I'm pointing this out. There's a lot of, heavens forbid, more people who are into um, trinification are getting onto this page. I'm so sorry, you don't, you shouldn't be looking at this place. I'm praying for the Holy Spirit. Is this a female tall woman? This is more or less Kenyan look, okay? She's Kenyan. I've been to Kenya. Beautiful women. Long arms. It's okay for women to have long arms if they're tall. Normal. Normal. Okay? Look at the back. See how it's sloping? Because the, the body is created so that if she were to get pregnant, it will fit here. Okay? And she'll have... A wider derriere because the cir circumference of it of that pelvis is big to push out the baby again okay even with clothing can you tell this is not the most pretty looking girl okay it slopes in now if this is a, uh, a tranny because we're not seeing the full body right this is this is gonna be very tricky This is actually very tricky. Look at this, okay? You have to see it to really examine it. You have to see it all the way because anybody can hyperextend their back. But you can see it's a very flat one, right? But can you tell? The deltoid is a little too big for a skinny girl. This might be a tranny, okay? Do you have to wonder if this is a woman? Do you have to wonder, just look at how her shoulder is sloping, okay? Look at how her arm is long, but it's not super long, okay? It's not too dangly, okay? 
it's fairly um, there's an outward slant on the arm of a female because the clavicle is short if the clavicle is taken out it's gonna dangle more this is not dangly okay meaning if, if this is like way out there this arm will be like thung, 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 thung. okay but because it's so close it's coming out okay so no question okay look at her face Okay, she's got a fairly wide chin, but it's oval, okay? Feminine, look at the eyebrow, okay? Right where it should be. Um, so here we go. Here's the thing that's gonna get you, okay? This is what they try to do. I don't know if this is natural or not, okay? They're trying to trick, see, she's got a short clavicle here, right? But look where it ends. It's right there. Big. Okay. What do you think? This is the look that the Kardashians are aiming for. Because this way, it is very hard to tell. The reason why it's so hard, okay, it's easier to tell here because it's a short torso and slopes out typical okay typical for african-american look at the clavicle okay where does the arm go it goes out goes out Here, again, very voluptuous look. You're looking at this portion here. Where is it the smallest? This they can fake. This part they can't. And do you see how that push it, pushes in? Okay. You can only do that when you have a smaller scapula that is not locking in place. Uh, the, the boobs may be fake. Okay, very hourglass. If it's a male body and they want to give it the hourglass shape, they put a lot of padding all the way around it. Okay. Not so many doctors, I think, can do that because it seems like they, you know, the Kardashians have the best doctors. They do didn't do nothing for pink. Another one. Okay, but this is a C. It's a C. Smaller arms too. This is not a very tall person, smaller arm. Okay. What do you see here? Okay, you got the bubble head, very feminine. Shoulder. Do you see too much deltoid? Small ribs. Okay, it sticks out, right? See where the arm is? Coming out. coming out we can see the small of the back so this is not going to be an easy one to tell but looking at the shoulder this looks like a feminine every tranny would die for that look okay what's it showing you right there right below See, Asian women, harder to tell, right? But do you see the C-curve? C-curve at the back. Okay, typical. Is her scapula big? Where is she indenting? Right there. Wide shoulder, though very skinny okay so um athletic female that's gonna be hard okay let's take a look at bridget bardell is this a female where do you see the small of the back is here 
right? That's a wide, that's a wider clavicle, fairly straight actually. What do you think of this one? It's right there, smack in the middle, appearing more like a taco, but it's a high one. Pink, no. That's a man. This one here, they tend to do that. They'll try to turn in their knee as much as they can to give it that cue angle. That's a man's back right there. I can't tell before where it is, but now it's like it's really down there. Ellen DeGeneres. Now this is a tricky one. It does look like a man. Not from the clavicle. They would not show her in bikini. But this does look like, just like Britney Spears, it looks like a man's back. Looking like a man. Ariana Grande, they would not show hers. <laughs> we gotta wait a few more years. They will not show her back. This here, highly suspicious, very straight clavicle, very long clavicle too. If you remove the arm, hers is going to be right outside, right outside. Remove this arm and she's gonna be right outside the pelvis. This may be an added fatty that they put in there special padding this here is uh, definitely stunted growth that's a big head that's a big head on a little body okay sternocleidomastoid is sticking out so much she's got the spoon that's a spoon prepubescent boy Boy, what a pretty little face. Mm. Ariana Grande means a grand song, a big song. I think this is for pedophiles to enjoy because she just look at her. She's about, I would say, she's about 4'8", no more than that. Stunted growth very stunted the arms look fairly long for some for a female this is a long arm for a female again is it dangly it's sticking out it's out right it's dangling um, almost <sighs> let's draw this you have the head here you have the scapula, you got the arm. Not a very good photo here. Okay, if the arm, if the pelvis is so small, if the pelvis is small, and if you remove the arm and you take it down and it's right outside of the pelvis, it's a typical male body. It's a typical male body. Typical male body. If it's a female, they'll tend to be either the same width as this or it will be bigger. That's a typical, again, typical. There's very few women who have a very um, compacted pelvis, but it does exist. 
but it's tilted forward it will still have a bigger 